Hello, Fear the Maker here, welcome to another episode of Let's Play. Uh, the world is not enough for the Nintendo 64. Uh, this level wasn't in the PlayStation 1 version. Okay, I think this is a stealth mission. Um, apparently we're not allowed to let them waste the alarm. Welcome to my nuclear family. That was a terrible joke. I have to get on board that sub before it's too late. So I don't know why I said I think this is a stealth mission. I know this is a stealth mission and I've tried it several times and died several times or failed the mission through the alarm being set off before I was able to complete the mission. So I know for 100% sure that I hate stealth missions. Because I'm bad at them. I am really bad at stealth missions. Fairly certain, as long as you don't give them much time to do it, that you can prevent the alarm going off, or at least prevent her death. I've to actually look at the objectives. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. I would say that as long as I don't shoot the, um, the sailors, then all I need to do now is rescue uh, Dr. Jones.
mean, I have to get out of my way here. Or at least there isn't a time limit. Sorry this is taking a while, Christmas. At least you don't have to wait till December 25th. Hopefully. I have so good been going on for far too long if that happens. be a great idea for a nuclear submarine to smash into the ocean floor. Still survived. So it seems like this is uh, this is the final level, and I'm going to uh, complete the final level in this episode. Uh, this is an underwater one. I suppose I'm going to have to work out what the controls are here, because I don't really actually know what the controls are. But in a minute when I get back onto it, you will see that there's a counter um, counting down in the middle there it's got a zero and a 500 and a 1000 and also um, to the uh, right of it um, in a minute there's going to be a counter saying how much oxygen I have left that will have a zero and a two on it and um, that will uh, that will be how that will appear when I go underwater and tell me how long I have till I drown. So according to a strategy guide, which I definitely need, it's the left uh, controller for upwards and downwards. Look, I'm going to be saving this sometimes. I know some people might frown on that, but this is not an easy level. this is where I'm supposed to go. But it is very hard to tell.
Okay, I think this is actually somewhere new. So I'm going to assume this is the right price. Of course, it's entirely possible that after all of this, um, the meltdown will happen and all of this will be pointless anyway. Exactly what I need, more confusing about where I have to go. Well, that was very complicated. Would have been nice to have a proper boss battle, but... Okay, so I guess now I need to leave.
some more again. Wow, I have to say, I really, really dislike that level. That level was exceedingly annoying. That seriously, the controls for that level were awful. Um, they were. The controls for that level were awful. The, the way that you have to pause while you're underwater with your oxygen running out to specifically move your, your head in order to be facing the right direction, in order to be able to go up or down or forwards or backwards. And I would have liked a better final cutscene as well. I know that we know that Christmas survived and Bond has survived, which is great. I just feel the film had a better ending than that, frankly. We, we should see in the last cutscene Bond getting together with, um, with her, you know? Maybe the cutscene's coming up in a sec. I don't know. Okay, at least there's something. I've always wanted to have Christmas in Turkey. Okay, so there's something. I'll I'll give it that. We do get to have this. But not on my channel for quite some time. I admit I'm a little sick of James Bond at this point. Look, that wasn't a terrible game. I thought the music was rather repetitive and it would have been nice if we'd had vehicle chases. Although I understand that there are, uh, there are uh, hardware limitations for the N64. And, uh, yeah, that last level was a pain. But, I admit, it wasn't bad. It was fun to play, there was lots of variety. I mean, there was stealth missions, there was all the underwater stuff, annoying though it was. Uh, there could have been more bosses, but there, were, there was a helicopter, at least. Um, there was uh, the, the nighttime uh, stuff with uh, you needing to get to the airfield. You know, there was variety. There was chase missions, even if they were on foot. Still, not a big fan of this game. Uh, thinking about it now. Um, it wasn't as good as I was hoping it was going to be. Still, I have uh, I have another game lined up uh, for my next Let's Play and uh, yeah, I'll let the credits fall and uh, I will see you next time. Oh, uh, there are there are multiplayer modes, but I'm not going to be doing those because, well, I can't really do multiplayer on this. And um, there are uh, different difficulty modes, but I'm not going to be doing those either because I I don't care. I'm sick of this game now. See you in my new Lux play.